I want to read what you wrote to me because I sent out an email on this general subject to my list and you wrote this back. You know what's most annoying about the you must mention slavery stuff? Everyone had slavery in the whole world. When Jamestown was settled in 1607, no one anywhere in the history of the world had criticized slavery as immoral. Abraham, Isaac, Jacob, and Moses owned slaves. Aristotle said it was natural. Jesus bucked convention by hanging out with prostitutes and Gentiles, besides having his followers perform various works on the Sabbath, but didn't criticize slavery. And Muhammad recruited followers by promising them shares of all the populations Muslim armies could enslave. In the 19th century, that included American sailors captured by the Barbary states. What was different about the modern West in this regard? The first arguments about its morality arose in the Anglosphere in the late 17th century. The first anti-slavery society was formed in Philadelphia in 1775, and the Royal Navy abolished the Middle Passage in the 19th century. Meanwhile, Saudi Arabia outlawed slavery in 1970. It's still common in Northwest Africa, etc. And by the way, how did Europeans end up with so many African slaves in the 16th and 17th centuries? Hmm. Yet these people never criticize other civilizations for having this once universal institution. They instead drum into people's heads that far from taking the lead in abolishing it, the West was alone in having it. Besides that, about 1 million of the 11 million Africans brought through the Middle Passage ended up in what is now the USA. And yet one never hears these people ragging on Brazil, Haiti, Cuba, Mexico, Nicaragua, Venezuela, Colombia, etc. Certainly not on Puerto Rico for having slaves. Polls show that young Americans think it's an American institution. America was founded on slavery in about the same way as it was founded on outdoor plumbing. It was a nasty fact of life throughout the world that we got rid of and never defended as a principle. See, this is the kind of email you get when you're Tom Woods. You get an email like that from Kevin Goodsman. 